Greetings all, it's the Devious Monkey here. It is 7.15 on Thursday. I have filmed a ton of shit all day and basically made it all irrelevant. So everything I talked about, mostly, was about the, obviously my little rant about this Crane M3 and I said I was gonna order some stuff and when I got it in, I'd put it together and I'd show you all about it. Okay, I'll just show you all about it. Here it is, I got it. So what I ended up getting was one of these, well, not one, but there's a couple of these little weights. And this thing is huge. It's a hell of a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. And this is the small one. So I can barely just get it up there and it actually goes into the threads of the stupid proprietary plate, which I will forever call it that. And then I ended up getting this Arca clamp and screwed that into the other side of the stupid proprietary plate. And I was able to use that, put the camera on, get it completely balanced with really not too much of a problem. And I filmed that I was using it and everything was, was good, I'd say. There was a little bit of an issue, like if you set it down on a table, and I've read this from other people that are even using the other annoying proprietary mechanism that Zune came out with, but it, if you set it down and you're not touching it, it starts to vibrate on its own. And uh, as soon as I'd grab it, it would stop doing it. So I don't know what the hell that's all about. Doesn't matter. Everything that I showed you, all this stuff that I got, well, all this stuff, I mean, the little weight and, and the uh, Arca clamp are kind of irrelevant at this point because after I got it in and put it all together, I thought, man, I, there's got to be some place that I'm missing something. And I looked on Small Rig's site again because I went back and I grabbed the plate that they made for the Crane M2. And that was a nice thin plate that went into their proprietary mechanism. But on this side, it had in line a very nice Arca compatible clamp. And that is what I needed. So long story short, I ended up finding one made by Fallcam. Fallcam is just becoming my go-to company here because they're making some really good shit. The Fallcam thing now replaces this entire mechanism. It just unhooks from right here, you drop it off there, and then their new mechanisms like this goes right up and clamps on that side, like this one does. But instead of having to have this really high additional Arca clamp or just using stupid proprietary plate, it's now one little mechanism, just like the small rig one. And it takes the square, universal, it basically is the Peak Design plate. It's the PGY Tech plate. It's a billion other plates that are compatible. And it even says compatible with like every other device that exists out there. I ordered it. Problem is, it's coming from China, so it could be weeks before I get it. And when I get that new plate, I will shoot a brand new video and I will show you everything about it and I'm sure I will sing its praises whilst having a little bit of phlegm in the back of my throat for Zeon. I'm not showing you anything else that I did today or any of that stuff. I went to the chiropractor. We made breakfast this morning. I walked around my house showing you how smooth this thing is. That's pretty much it. Oh, and I went to Target because I forgot to get cat litter the past week. That's it. That's all you're going to get today. I didn't even feel like doing this, but Yankee Cowboy's like, come on, dude. And I'm like, okay, fine. So this is a, a almost like a one take thing. I'm not, I'm just going to cut out some of the you know stupider shit that I said because I haven't been able to speak today. And there's a lot of stutters and long pauses in there. Kind of like every other day. So that's it. That's all you get for today. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. As always, thanks for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember, kids, forward and up.